Oh, how do, Matthew? Is the afternoon train due soon? Well, been and gone a half an hour ago. She's waiting for you on the platform. She? There's been a big mistake. Not if you're Mr. Matthew Cuthbert. You are Mr. Matthew Cuthbert, aren't you? It's a girl. I can see that. Where's the boy? There weren't any. Just her. I figure we just couldn't leave her there. She's no good for us. We might be of some good to her. Rachel Lynn deserves what she gets. Matthew Cuthbert, don't form opinions for me. Next you'll be saying she oughtn't to be punished at all. Did you ever go courting, Matthew? No, I don't know as I have. Never, ever, ever? Why ever not? Well, I couldn't do it without talking to a girl. Well, I'm sure there were many broken hearts as a result. Oh, go on. Just fill her head with nonsense. Fact is, Morella, you never went to a ball. That little girl ought to have all the kindness we can give her. We got no call to raise her as cheerless as we was. Well, uh, since you suggest it, uh, it wouldn't be too much trouble. Uh, yes? Sugar. Sugar? How much would you like? Uh, would 20 pounds be enough? Yes, I'm sure 20 pounds will be enough. Mm -hmm. Brown sugar, indeed. I knew Matthew was up to some foolishness. Look at the puffs. I should have waited till Christmas, but I thought you might want to wear it to the ball. Don't you like it? Like it? It's more exquisite than any dress I could ever have imagined. I don't want to get your dress dirty. <laughs> <laughs> 